Get ready, Los Angeles, as we kick off our Real Show 2017. Real 92.3 backstage at the Real Show with Jesse Reyes. My favorite. <laughs> She is a lot of people's favorite, but yes, we especially love here her, love her at the neighborhood. Uh, Jesse, how are you? How what's you've been doing so much? Yes, man, I'm good. I'm happy to be here. Happy to see familiar faces. Yes. Um, I just actually got back from London like five hours ago, or wow, or eight hours ago, something <laughs> like that. I don't know, but anyways, um, uh, it was my first show since releasing the last song phone mm -hmm. calls uh -huh. so it was the first time that like a whole room was singing it along and we decided <laughs> to do it first in the set right it was dope it was hella dope so how do you manage having to go from here to there to a different country and then back and then still be you and give everything to your fans oh man all i gotta do is remember like all i gotta do is remember the hustle and like remember like the days where I was praying for someone to like listen to my music yeah. or the days where I was like spamming everybody being like, hey, like please listen to my stuff or like busking or bartending late nights like at the register wishing I was making music, you know? Yeah. What do you what are you loving the most right now being on the road and singing everywhere? Because I feel like literally you're like from place to place yep. to place. It's like, where is she going next? <laughs> Yo, man, the best thing, like one of the dopest things is legit being like half a world away from the city I was born in. Mm -hmm. And then having a whole crowd singing along lyrics, and it was like that's insane already. Like being so far away from home, and then having that 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 intimacy yeah. with people I've never met, but then feeling that like love, like wow. instant love, that's crazy. The second thing is like a lot of those songs are sad songs, or like things that I went through that were like that have impacted yeah. me mm -hmm. negatively, right? And so when I'm in the studio and I'm making those songs, it feels dark, and then. I, on stage I'll I'll be singing and if I close my eyes I get to in my feelings and I feel that darkness and then I hear people singing and I open my eyes mm. and it's like heaven and it's like darkness and heaven and that contrast is so beautiful yeah. those I two love things. that yeah what do you miss most about being home my nieces and my nephews Aww. that's 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 like the killer because my mom and dad I was able to bring them on tour and yeah. stuff they were for so like cute last year. Yo, they're the they best so cute that was the best but like my brother and my family my sister-in-law and the kids and stuff my cousins my aunts my uncles that's what I miss you know are you gonna get a chance to be with them for Thanksgiving since it's around the corner do you so yeah do you celebrate United States Thanksgiving or can uh, Canada Thanksgiving? Yo, any excuse to eat okay? <laughs> <laughs> I celebrate both any excuse to eat <laughs> But, no, I think I'm actually going to be on the road. I think the next time I actually get to be home, home is, like, second week of, cr of December. Wow. Yeah, but still, like, I mean, it makes, the one positive thing about that is, like, the heart, the, what is it, distance makes the heart grow fonder. That's yeah. very true. You know, that's the positive way to look at it. It just makes me miss them and love them more. We've seen a, a big change, or not so much a change just yet, but a lot has been going on in Hollywood with a lot of people coming out and finally sharing their stories of sexual mm -hmm. harassment, sexual misconduct, mm -hmm. and you, I mean, I gave, introduced the song to, to all of us in the, in the neighborhood of Gatekeeper. What has it been like for you, having already told your story, but now all these other women coming in as well and expressing their stories? It's wild. It's like two sides to the coin, because it's dope that there's that there's a conversation that's on the forefront of shit mm -hmm. like that of mm -hmm. things that are current right now. Mm -hmm. But the other side is like it's unfortunate it's twenty seventeen and right. it's a common thing that a lot of people were like, Oh, we didn't know or and it's not even their fault. You can't blame ignorance on people that have just never experienced it, particularly mm -hmm. men, because a lot of men don't know what it's like for every mm -hmm. day as mm -hmm. females in any industry to feel that kind of oppression or to feel or like face those kind of adversities. You can't blame them for their ignorance just because they've never been through it. Yeah. But what I rate and what I love right now is everyone that hasn't been through it standing up as advocates against yeah. it. Yeah. That's dope. It's unfortunate. Like, sometimes I w like, I'm not going to put anyone out there, but I've had, like, a couple guys say, like, why the hell have they, they waited so long? I wouldn't have said. Like, I would have said something right then and there. And I'm trying to explain to them, like, how, like, you can't understand what they've been through because yeah. you haven't been there. Don't. But what advice can you give to a young girl who maybe hasn't said something yet and to give them the courage? The first thing I can say is she could throw a big middle finger at anyone trying to judge her for holding back or feeling that fear because no one can tell you about your situation. Mm -hmm. No one can tell you about what you're facing or the de like the demons that you've had to hold on to. So anyone that has an opinion on how you should move could shut up. That's mm -hmm. the first thing. And second of all, that like don't be too hard on yourself because people choose different things and and like this is your this is this is your life and mm -hmm. like you're supposed to make mistakes and you can't 
you if, if anything find solidarity in numbers and the fact that so many women are coming out now and for men that don't do it think of prison man if guys got if a lot of dudes looked at it like how they move in prison mm-hmm. and if a guy got got it you know what i mean the if same. a guy got it the right. same and then the guy's gonna come out of the bin and then say what a guy's gonna tell all his friends that that's what he went through it hell the hell no, mm-hmm. like no he's not gonna say it mm-hmm. he's gonna feel that fear he's gonna feel ashamed he's not gonna know how to move even though it wasn't his fault that he got that he got it oh, i love you so much thank love you that. so much thank you. what are you looking forward to to 2018 2017 Tell has us. been amazing for you but what are you looking forward to for 2018 oh more touring man <laughs> more crowd surfing more crying more hustle more no sleep more family on the road hopefully grammys and if not this year the next year a farm for my pops orphanages or like like charities a lot of stuff man i just want to i just want to stay on track and like keep my focus and I don't want to get complacent. I mean, I don't want to get too happy. You know what I'm saying? I, I love just want to stay grounded. <laughs> what about your music? What can your fans look forward to? Oh, you know what music. they can look forward to? <laughs> I, they was Let at, yo, know. yo, we have a Spanish song coming out soon, which I'm so yeah. excited oh for, Oh, my man. God. Because it's, it's going to fire, thank you. you guys. Like, thank you. I literally was, like, screaming. <laughs> I was so excited. You killed it. I wish I could have shared because I have a clip yeah. of her performing it. I know. I but know. I had to ask you. I was like, thank can I release you. this? She's like, not yet. But. No. It's because it's hella, it's hella, hella new. Thank you for checking with me. No, That's but dope. you killed it. Are you planning to do more Spanish or is we that? We got bare Spanish songs, like, like saved up. We were just holding on to them. Like, I even had one before Kiddo dropped, but there's a few songs that I knew that I just wanted to wait until we had a bigger platform. I knew what I wanted for Kiddo. And then what's crazy, man, is amazing. that we don't have, li- like, up until that day was the first time I ever performed that oh, one, right? I feel so special. And it's not like we, we've, like, um, like, Spanish is my first language, mm-hmm. you know, Familia de Colombia, so, like, that's nothing new to me, you know? But it just so happens that a Spanish song wasn't on the project. And despite that, at all the shows, the, the like, mix of people in the audience and the Latino present and, like, ev- everything, which is, which is crazy. Uh-huh. We're seeing, like, Colombian flag yes. and, like, people, so you know amazing. what I mean? And we didn't even, we haven't even put something like that out, out yet. yet. But f- to have that connection yeah. already, I just can't wait till we drop it. Blow. Well, we got something that we don't want to hold on to any longer. I if you can grab it, if you see the red balloon over here. Oh! Close your eyes. Yeah, close your eyes. Close, close your, your eyes. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. This is a present <laughs> that we got for you. Oh, thank you. You have to. Oh, open I love it. it. Oh my God, you, don't, you guys don't understand how much I fucking love surprises, man. <laughs> but you gotta look at it very carefully. Oh, thank you. Yo, this is legit. You know, like, set. We're kind of running out of. So yeah. so look, look at the back. But look at the back. Oh this is God, this is specifically this? for you. We had it made. If you lift Can up I the collar, yeah, <laughs> yeah, do you? <laughs> if you lift up the collar, there's little things everywhere oh that are all you. Oh my god, I love this. Aww. This is the fucking best. <laughs> oh my god. The diamonds, it says it's diamonds. Look at this. This is the fucking best. Aww. Oh, I just like ruled on <laughs> <laughs> This is so dope, man. I legit. This, you know why this means so much to me, right? Because it's handmade, fucking. Mm-hmm. There was a lot of love put into it. Thank you so much. Thank you guys so much, man. This is the fucking dopest. I'm going to fucking rock this. I'm going to rock this on stage. Thank you, man. Jesse, one more thing. (laughs) Uh, Who would you be? (laughs) I'll get it. I'll get you the info. (laughs) Look at all the info, like all your lyrics. Oh, my God. Can you just like zoom in on the info? (laughs) Zoom in. That's so cool. This is the fucking dopest. (laughs) Thank you, guys. Sorry, go ahead. I'm not up in it. Who are you looking forward to? Working with as far as music goes, what's your list My looking list? like? Who's Frank on your Ocean, list? Ocean, Kid okay. Cudi, Princess Nokia, Kali Uchis, a <laughs> lot of people that I like. Everybody to work with, hell yeah, man. Okay, we're gonna throw it out in the universe so it comes it's back yeah. in 2018. Yeah. I hope. Los hey, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. And one thing I would love for you to do, if you don't mind, because I got to join you in prayer before you went on stage. Will you do prayer with us? Yeah, right now. Will you lead us in prayer? Hell Okay, cool. That's different. Because I just, I literally, I I was so moved by your prayer. I thought it was just so humbling, and it just felt so genuine, and cool. I would love for you to do that for of us. Of course. Okay, cool. But uh, everyone in the room that wants yeah. to participate, because I feel like it's strange that people <laughs> <can> watch. <laughs> so anyone that wants to participate in prayer, Anybody else? please feel free to jump in. Um, oh, we're good. <laughs> Dear God, thank you so much for allowing us to be here today. Thank you so much for allowing us to all be surrounded around positive people right now. God, please help us continue to stay focused and stay grateful for everything that you put in front of our path. Thank you so much for allowing us to wake up this morning. God, please guide us through today and everyone that's going to be on that stage. 
thank you so much for allowing us all to wake up today. Thank you so much for allowing us to breathe. Please continue to keep us safe. Thank you for the health of our families. Thank you for the health of our friends. Thank you, thank you, thank you for spirits, to our ancestors, to the universe, and to our energy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Please help us keep gratitude in our hearts and help us stay present. Amen. Amen. Thank you, love. Backstage, real show. Jesse Vance, guys. Bye. Okay, bye. <laughs> Our Real Show 2017.